Bon. Magnificent. And another. I think this side is much more stable. I'll fetch another plate. Right. <sighs> How do you like the new dress, sweet pea? <gasps> it's a lovely, <laughs> darling. Oh, excellent. I want everyone talking about this day for years. Mayor Higgins. Oh, what now? Frank says he's getting impatient. Shh, not now. Can't you see we're in the middle of something? I'm sorry, sweet pea. It, this is something I really have to take care of. Don't you worry about me, darling. Oh, okay, stay right here. I, I'll be back in a jiffy. I need more time. Try to distract Frank. I really need to check the flower arrangements. Yes, sir. <sighs> Bye for now. Finally, I thought he'd never leave. Need to work fast, get what I need, and leave before I get dragged to the altar. First, I need a key to the upper floor. I think she carries a spare. Bet she won't mind if I borrow it for a spell. The guards won't bother me so long as I don't misbehave too much. As soon as I get it, I'll sneak in through the library door. The upper floor is off limits. I'll have to avoid the guards until I reach the office. I'll turn the place upside down until I find what I'm here for. All right, then. I need to get out of here before the groom decides to check in on his bride. Don't mind me. I have to give him one thing. The dress is beautiful. Space. Quick. Jesus. That dog hates me. The feeling's mutual. Oh, it's gonna be wonderful. He's been waiting so long. I object this union. Just a little more. Yes, very nice. Hello, Mary. I like your walk. I'll lift the key from her. The guy on the balcony seems a little too fixated on her. Let's blind him a little with this perfume. Oh. Well, you look a little uneven there, that, don't you? Thank you. Ah. Got it. Now up the stairs and through the door to the library. Here comes I have the been watching you for a long time now. Is that? Don't mind me. Just some small touches. Yes, don't worry. That's what Mayor Higgins would want. Give the bride her space. Space. There's the door. I'll slip inside when no one's watching. Here comes. Sorry, and we need a rest. Drop somewhere. I object this you. I know just where to hit. I got good aim. Old. Not like this, no. Quick. Now for a little game of hide and seek. Huh? Strange. 
Maybe I fell over. Uh, who uh, the hell did that? Your ass is mine. That's a brave uh, now. Uh, huh. I'll find Must you. Must have been really tired. Here comes the runaway bride. Where's the Joker who hit me? Yeah. Don't mind me. You ain't fooling me. All right. Almost there. And now to find these papers. Get it, get it, get it. I object this union. Shit. It must be here somewhere. Frank, so you found my office. You should keep your friends waiting, Hagen. Eh, well, sorry about that. The wedding, you understand. Of course. Eh, there's the food, the decorations, the blast. Let's get this done. I got a train to catch. Of course. Just give me a moment. Did I hear correctly? There was trouble in Flagstone yesterday. The usual. I can imagine Mr. DeVitt isn't too happy about that. DeVitt isn't here. I wonder if he'd want you to leave things unfinished here. Or is there something more important in New Orleans? <laughs> Maybe you should just get back to your wedding, Higgins. Maybe you're right. Wouldn't want the bride to get nervous. Well, she has every reason to be. Pardon? I don't think she'll be happy when she finds out you sold off her family ranch. Well, she doesn't have to find out until after the wedding, right? <laughs> you know... I don't think it will make much difference in the end. Enjoy your wedding, Higgins. Hey, wait a second. I need a drink. to do this alone? This ain't a discussion. So, what's your plan? Get in, find Frank, do what I came for. Mm -hmm. March through the front gate. There's a path down those cliffs. I'll just follow that and climb up those vines. From there, I'll wing it. That's no plan, amigo. I've pulled off flimsier once. If I think something's up, I'll come and get you. No, you stay put. This is my fight. <sighs> Whatever you say, amigo. Mm -hmm. Gotta find another way. Hey, 
Hey. Sure thing. Shall we? This is one of the strangest wedding gifts I have seen in my home. You hear that? It's now or never. I just need a few seconds. Here goes. Okay. Let's go. Is that... trick in the book. Uh, heads or tails? All right. Who needs a good killing? It's not like Frank to just ride off like that. Well, would you want to stay around and babysit the mayor if you could get out of it? <laughs> you hear that? Hmm. Neat. Ah. No problem. The hell? Okay, then. What the...? Oh, it's gonna be wonderful. He's been waiting so long for her to grow up. I wish I was married to him. That deal with the DeVitt company made him rich. Well, we can't all be as lucky Here as Miss O'Hara. It's not like Frank. I just need a few seconds. What's that? Are huh? you being weird on purpose? All in my words make it quick. Head or keep my head down. Wouldn't want to break any of these fine things. No. Shall we? Knife will do. <laughs> Let's get going. I got lots of these. What's that noise? I bring it on. Got me. Here goes. Yeah, minus the dignity. You really think I'd marry a 
conniving charlatan? It's all pretty cozy in here. Looks like the mayor's doing all right for himself. Something's going on in that room. Let's have a look. You're nothing but a greedy fuck. Please, okay? This is not the time nor place. And up. You've no decency, you thieving two-bit excuse. Is for a man? Sure. Sweet pea, please. I only want what's best for you. Need sure. Ah. Okay then. Nice. I'm offering you more than your uncle could ever give. On my way. Come on. Yeah, minus the dignity. You really think I'd marry a conniving charlatan? Of course you'll marry me. You just need to calm down a bit. Let's go. You're nothing but a greedy fuck. Please, go. Kate, this is neither the time nor place. You've no decency, you thieving two-bit excuse for a man. Hurry up. Sweet pea, please. I only want what's best for you. It's done. Nothing I can do now. Call him back. Kate, please. We have a wedding ahead of us. Now calm down, will you? Time's wasting. You really still think I was going to marry you? Enjoy your wedding. Uh, uh, not so fast. You have no idea how much I've invested in this. You will marry me today. You're going to play the good little wife. And I bet you'll forget all about your old life after you pop out a few children. <clears throat> Tempting, but I must decline. What the hell are you doing, Kate? Just trying to be convincing. Oh. Oh, yeah? Well, I'm going to show you your place in this world, you stupid... <laughs> I think I know my place. I reckon he deserved that. Who the hell are you? I could ask you the same. I don't have time. Step aside. <laughs> really? To the office! Move it! You sure you want to go this way? Shit. What the shit? Open the fucking door! I'm gonna take this. <laughs> Case closed. Okay, what now? The balcony door? Works for me. Wait. What are you doing? He doesn't need that money anymore. Money, huh? Heads down. Right. Close call. They're gonna search everywhere now. I have to warn my uncle. Let's get out of here. Well, tell me something first. You ever heard of a guy called Frank? Yeah. Let's discuss it on the way, if you don't mind. No chance we'll get through there. Not without some serious firepower. You know how to pull the trigger of a Gatling gun? I sure do. But, um, why does it have a pink ribbon? It's a wedding present. Don't ask. Anyway, I don't think I'll get very far in this bloody dress. Let's visit that maid up on the stage. I can steal her clothes and use them to blend in. Sure. Though, I don't see a gal like you blending in anywhere, Miss, uh... O'Hara. Kate O'Hara. I'll take that as a compliment, Mr... Uh, Cooper. John Cooper. So, about Frank, any chance you know where you went? I might. Can you offer me something in exchange, Mr. Cooper? How about my undying loyalty till we escape? I'll take that. Then what else? Sure thing. I just need a few seconds. The show goes on. I got lots of these. 
Oh, no. Let's see. Okay. I got good aim. Exit stage left. You hear that? Wouldn't take you for a man who throws away money. It's just pennies. Every penny counts, Mr. Cooper. Not if they're fake. Ouch. What? Better than a knife to the throat? Uh, I'm not sure which would hurt more. Let's give him some trouble, sir. Uh, time for a okay. nap. Let's go. Don't worry about me. Hmm. Need you. Hmm. No problem. Hurry up. Come on. Get going. O'Hara had it in her. She's got to be hiding somewhere to keep your eyes peeled. Hurry up. Oh, let's make it quick. <sighs> On my way. Wait a second. Noise. Mm -hmm. Not for you. No problem. Anyone there? going. Let's leave quietly. Let's put him down. That should knock him out for a while. Love the color. Let's try this on for size. like a wolf in maid's clothing. You think it's enough to fool him? Only one way to find, find out. Let's leave this mess of a party. I've had Warner, you must have seen something. Hear that, girls? Yeah. Quite the excitement. Eyes open. Hurry up. Wait forever. Exit stage left. I suggest we get moving. Mayor was killed. 
still got, damn it! How dare you do shotgun in his office? Damn, he got fired. Shame we gotta kill him. Let's leave this hey. mess of a party. Shouldn't be hard to spot her. <laughs> that. I say good riddance. I'll ask again. Did Stop any of you see her? Oh, come on. How the hell did that happen? Oh, oh. Let's leave quietly. What do I do? This is just wrong. The show goes on. Halfway out of here. So, what was that back there about warning your uncle? The DeVic company's gonna attack my uncle's ranch tonight. I gotta get word to him. Who needs to get bloody? What was that back there about warning your uncle? The DeVic company's gonna attack my uncle's ranch tonight. I gotta get word to him. Let's dazzle him. I suggest we get moving. I was wondering. Yeah. How can I help you? Oh, man. Hey, now. Let's see. You're giving me ideas. I'm here all day, honey. Handsome fellow like you. Sure, uh, whatever you need. See anything you'd like? Uh, uh, I'm all ears, honey. Quite the excitement. Nice talking to you. See you uh, later, maybe? Let me ask you something. Well, how can I help you? What's up? See anything you'd like? All right, I'm all ears, honey. Have a nice day. Come back later, okay? I was wondering. How can I help you? How's it going? Mm hmm. There's more where that came from. Sure, hey. Whatever you need. What do you think? Yeah, no problem, Missy. What can I see you later, sweetheart? Hey, not fair. I suggest we get moving. You're a capable hand, Mr. Cooper. My uncle could use your help at the ranch. Sorry, Miss O'Hara. Not my line of work. Let's leave this mess of a party. Time for my day there, good looking. Yeah. Ready. I bet I can help you. On my way. Let's make it quick. Got any plans right now? You got a lovely voice. Not a problem. Handsome fellow like you. Whatever you say, gorgeous. Hmm. Need sharpening. Ah. It's now or never. Okay, let's get going. Careful. That's a guard dog up there. She'll sniff me out no matter what I'm wearing. She hates me. I say good riddance. Sure thing. Hey. Be up, will ya? Who cares now if you get okay. a few scratches on it? Let's go. I know, I know. Still, mm, it's a gorgeous piece of steel. 
change, darling. You're done. I, I could talk to you I all day. Say, I'm working on this again it. sometime. Oh, not fair. Mm. Mm. I'll work my charms. Exit stage left. We're I was both gonna shoot her. Right. The hell? What do you think? Do we have to wait you forever? Have a nice day. Love to see you Handsome. later, maybe? It's now or never. Violent delights. Hey, don't push me. I say good riddance. Out of my mind. Yeah. This is much better than standing guard. Let's leave quiet. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Exit stage left. I say good riddance. Here goes. Listen, Mr. Cooper. If you help us defend the ranch, I'll tell you where Frank went. I have to wait forever. No. But what if one of us has to take a shit? Oh, I didn't think of that. Just a harmless sneeze. I've had enough of weddings. Perfume from my late suitor. Oh, well, I guess love is blinding after all. Oh, shame on you, Mr. Cooper. Oh, what do we do for on... those who try? Oh, now. Well, we see. blast them to hell. Hmm. Need sharpening. Hmm. Sorry, I'm, I'm awake. I'm awake. So you must be Mr. Cooper's friend. Ah, yeah, and you are. Kate O'Hara. Pleasure to meet you. Yeah. Hey, Hector. So, uh, how was the wedding? Stop trying to impress a lady. We're heading out. Listen, I got someone that could help us. Damn good marksman. Thing is, he doesn't work for free. I'm sure Higgins has no objection to this investment. All right, Hector, you go with Miss O'Hara. I think we have until sundown before the DeVitt men come for the ranch. I'll see you there. You got it, amigo. Thank you, Mr. Cooper. Uh, no need to thank me. We have a deal, don't we? This Frank must be a hell of a guy if you risk your life like this to find him. Wouldn't be the first time. Well, you better hurry. We'll be ready for you at the ranch. Let's hope so. So, why are we defending a ranch now? Well, 
It's a long story. I'll explain on the way. Sure.